Hello there, it's Mike Parsons here with Bluegrass with Friends, and uh, I'd like to say thanks to John Tate for requesting a song, and today we're going to do Deep Illum Blues and show you how to play it in the key of E. Now, E is not a key that's used a lot. Well, it's used a ton, but most fiddle players have a hard time playing with it, so I figured that this would be a great one to kind of learn the key of E. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is just play the song a little bit. If you go down to the deep willow, keep your money in your shoe. Women in deep willow, got them deep willow blues. chords. Here's what we're doing is we got this E chord, got my first finger on the D string and my first finger on the A string making an E and a B note. Now the four chord is A. A and E are open together. The D and the uh, first finger on the D string and the open A, or the first finger on G and D. There's your A chord. Back to one, which is the E. So that's the first finger on the A, a B note on the open E, or the E and B on the middle two strings. Or you put the second finger over here on the bottom string and play B and E, okay? And then the five chord, oh, sweet mama, that's a B chord. So I've got the second finger on both of those strings, B and F sharp. Put the first finger, keep the second finger on the D string, first finger on the first two strings. So this is F sharp and B. And again, B and F sharp. So here's our one, four, five pattern. One, four, five, one, one, four, five, one. All right. And so here's the basic melody. exactly perfect but you get the idea and then here we go to this D sharp oh sweet mama and he's got them deep feeling blues all right so let's talk about that melody that's E E D C sharp D C sharp and it repeats that several times so this that's a D natural the normal uh, tone in an E scale, it would be D sharp. So this flatted seventh note makes it a blues note in my mind. Here's the flatted three, this G natural. So I'm sliding that from G natural up to G sharp. C-sharp, B, sliding my G-sharp down to G and then back to E. Okay, so not going to be able to cover this whole thing today, but you get kind of the idea. And then here's the five chord, what I did for my intro. So that's B, C, C, B, C-sharp, B, D-sharp, F-sharp. And then sliding that third finger again, this is in a B chord, the 
the, sh the normal three slid to a flat three, up to the normal three, and back to the root. So hopefully that gives you a little uh, insight into the playing in the key of E. And uh, thanks for your comments and keep on picking.